Hello, this is David Puckett with Southeastern Industrial Linings. This video documents the complete rehab of two Marley Aqua Towers. The top edge of the cold water basin has rusted completely off. You can see the massive amount of scale rust that has accumulated in the cold water basin. The cooling tower panels have several holes, each measuring several inches across. Here you can see the severely degraded condition of the cooling tower panels. The rust and corrosion is removed using an EcoQuip vapor blaster. This unit uses water and garnet fired at high velocity leaving the metal both white and with an adequate profile for the lining system application. The vapor blasting is now complete. We are ready to apply our two-step priming system. This is the first step of our priming system. This is step two of our priming system. The priming is complete. We're now ready for the polyurea lining system. The technician is spraying the polyurea and using a Teflon blade to paddle the poly into the cracks and crevices in the tower. He has about five seconds to do this before the polyurea turns solid. A sheet metal patch has been placed over the hole using polyurea. We spray the poly, bed the sheet metal into it, and then simply coat over it. No welding or screws are required. Here the technician is placing a smaller sheet metal patch over a hole and spraying it in. Areas that are corroded but not bad enough for a steel plate are repaired using a geotextile membrane. Here the technician is using geotextile to repair a corroded section in the tower. The geotextile is bedded in using polyurea and then coated with poly and smoothed out with the Teflon paddle. Here are some shots of the finished polyurea lining system. Polyurea is applied at about 2000 psi and at about 165 degrees. It turns solid in about seven to eight seconds after you spray it and once cured it has about a 2,000 pound tensile strength. With the priming system that we use in the towers it requires several hundred pounds of pull to separate the lining system from the metal. Yeah. 
the new replacement media is being installed. A thin panel is required to put the last block of media in. Here are the panels being removed. The towers are now ready to be put back into use.